Oh my gosh, look at the damage I just did. Oh my gosh! What is- dude! Wow! Wow! You're done! Woo! No way! Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. We are now in the Akala region. We're, we're making our rounds around Hyrule. Yeah, we are. It is good that we are finally potentially going back to Terrytown. The home we made from ground up. Lots more to see. Let's hop into it, guys. Hello, hello everyone. Welcome, welcome. My name is Steb. If it's your first time here, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. And today we are going to continue where we left off. We did a little bit of off screen, very little bit. Uh, eh, somewhat a little bit. Okay, we, we did a little bit of underground. You know, it, it's not super exciting, especially when we have our Steba cycle. Went ahead and just got a lot of the light routes associated with this area. We did, you know, kind of stop at some point. There's there's a few areas that look somewhat interesting, so I wanted to wait to, to you know, include you guys. You know, I'm not going to miss anything massive. Uh, got a few light routes. We did find a bargainer statue here. Something that I noticed is that a lot of the bargainer statues are below where goddess statues are. So, for example, like this one. The first one that we found was underneath the Temple of Time Bargainer statue. Oh, well, this one, maybe not. I don't, I don't know what this one's associated with. But I do feel like this one is below. If you guys remember this place, this is one of the locations where Zelda went to in the first game uh, to to kind of try to regain her goddess powers. And so this was where I see the Wellspring of Power. So I think this is like the um, the Temple of Power or whatever that that's I. We're going to visit there and check, but I'm fairly certain there's a goddess statue here. So that's a pretty cool association. But yeah, I thought that maybe we'll start today by, you know, tackling a very quick little boss. And then we're going to go down, descend and do this stuff and then go into the depths. We're just going to go all the way up and down, starting here. And then we're going to make our ways around Akala. What's up, fella? Nice, easy one, two, easy clap type of boss thing right here. Just, just, to, just to get a little taste for the day. You know what I'm saying? Get a little warm up. What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Oh, shoot. Oh! Give me your head. Your brother's soul is mine. Look at that damage. Oh, yeah. Master Sword smackity smack smack. One more sequence and we're good to go, man. All right. He's already doing this stuff. Y'all already know all we got to do is wait last minute. Do some of this. Do some of that. Hop right on. And we're sitting easy. It's over. It's already done. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Yep. Where are you at? Where are you at? It's over. It's over! Flux Construct 3 Easy Clap. I could I could do that whole thing uncut and it would make it into a short, you know what I'm saying? A steak. Oh great! We could actually use these. I didn't know these were actually part. Wow, that's fantastic, actually. Um, okay, what are we gonna stick this on? <laughs> Woo -wee! Oh, baby, 65 damage. It's not that much, but it's a good amount. It's a good amount. Okie dokie. Fantastic. Fantastic. An old map. Fantastic. Where is it for? You already found the treasure shown on this old map. Fantastic. Okay, so that answers a question that I had before where like is it randomly generated but no they, they're all associated to a particular treasure that's cool okay fantastic so where do we go from here well you know i thought it'd be a good idea to just go down i wanted to to land here take a quick breezy look around uh and then i remember that there was supposed to be a treasure here which was part of the fierce deity set if i remember correctly um, and then, you know, we'll, we'll take a look around. This is going to be a shrine and then we'll hop into this chasm to get into here because there's another treasure here that we want to get. Lots of treasure hunting today. Lots of treasure hunting. Whee! Oh, wow. We weren't even that much higher than this place. I guess either this is really elevated or that was very low. Oh, the hole's right there, actually. Hold on. I didn't realize that there was a hole on top here. We actually should probably go here first. I didn't realize how elevated this was. Holy. All right, we're going for the treasure then. Wow, look at this. This is what we're going to be exploring today. Yep, it's already thunderstorming. It's going to be raining a lot, it seems. Wow, look at this. This is so cool. This is super cool. And this isn't even like going into the depths, is it? Unless. No, it's not. Is this water? This is water. Nope. Stupid. I think it's nice where if you get a headshot, it auto kills these. Okay, oh, I'm missing. I'm just wasting arrows now. Being a little bit reckless here. 
You're up, buddy. Whee! Is this a cave? It's considered a cave. Okay, we got to find the bubble gem then. We, w we went back and we recovered all the bubble gems that we didn't find last time in those few caves. And there was like three or four that we missed somehow. Okay, lots of skellies. Where the heck am I? We're like pretty deep in, aren't we? Oh, what the? I see the armor piece up there already. Did not expect to see you here. All right, I guess that makes sense. There's so many freaking stealth creatures. Oh no, already running low, huh? Alrighty then. You got him already? Wow, we have grown a lot. Our weapons are so strong. I think the unfortunate thing is that the style creatures don't really have different tiers of strength. Like the stalls, like the style knocks is always going to be a style knocks. There's not like a, a silver style knocks, right? Okay, I'm going to look for the bubble frog first and then we'll get that armor piece. Ah, that must be the bubble frog. You're up. What's up, buddy? Thank you. Give me the armor piece. I think it's going to be a fierce deity set piece, right? Woo, it's the mask. Oh my gosh, it's so weird that it actually changes his face, his eyes. I like it though. Dang, we're missing just, I think, the chest piece now. Awesome, man. Should we just rock this for now? Yeah, let's just rock it. We're rocking it. We can't get the full set bonus yet because we don't have the full set. Up we go. Where the heck am I? Yeah, that's super tall. I didn't realize that there's a hole up there. Oh my good golly gosh. There's a lot of stuff here, right in there. Oh, we're right next to the shrine though. Okay, let's get the shrine. Kamatuka shrine. A precise strike. Oh no, this is a golf thing. And then there's probably a harder golf thing here. Yeah, okay, I, I, I know what we're doing. We're, we're playing golf, we're playing golf. Like, is this gonna work though? Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Oh wow, we got pretty close. Oh! Oh, frick! That's gotta be it. Okay. Oh, come on! No way! Oh, I can't actually cross. Oh, shoot. Okay, hold on, hold on. I, I'm pretty sure there's a way for me to cross over and just to stick it in. Oh, it made it. Oh. <laughs> the heck? Oh, thank you very much. We gotta do the one on the right side, though. It's moving. Okay, that's not too bad. Seems good. No. Come on, let's go! Let's go! Easy, easy clap. Wow. We'll take it. That's actually pretty good. That's actually pretty good. Okie dokie. One, two, easy clap. We have four blessings. Fantastic. I don't think we need to go rush and grab our, our heart right now. It's not going to make a huge difference. We'll hold on to it. We'll hold on to it. Oh my gosh. I feel, yeah, if I remember correctly, this area rains a lot. What the heck? What are you doing out here? You're about to fall into the lake, buddy. Who are you even advertising to? Mm, okay, this is cool. So these are like auto floaty blocks, right? Can we actually use this to help hold this up? That'll just hold it up, right? Just put this here. Yeah, so this should be okay, right? Wait, these floating blocks are actually OP, huh? These floating blocks are OP for Hudson Signs. Yeah, wow, floating blocks OP. It's standing. Give me my money and skedaddle, Addison. Get out of my face. Ooh, and there's a Korok nearby, huh? Aimbot. I was wondering if we could shoot through those. Nope. Yeah. Sick. I need to reach my friend. Shut up. I, I guess. Okay, we'll take care of this. Get on there. Oh, you know what? Guys, I discovered a Mark IV version of the step -a cycle I'll show you guys when we get to the depths. But remember how I was complaining about the light problem? Something happened on accident, and then it actually made things so much better without any cost of battery, without needing to use a flashlight. I'll show you guys what I mean. It doesn't serve any purpose in the overworld because we have a plenty of light here, but yeah. What's up, buddy? Thank you. Okay, well, I guess now the plan is just to go straight into the depths. Let's get that treasure. There's a treasure right underneath the eye of the skull. We're gonna reach the hole, please. Ooh, yes. Almost broke my shins. It's so dark. I freaking hate it. But it's not too dark because we already lit everything up. Wow, look at this creepy place, huh? Okay, that's a Stalnox. 
Okay, well, we, we killed plenty of you. This should be easy clap. What? Really? All right, then. Oh my gosh, I'm getting ganked. You already had a little boss rush style version earlier. You guys think you are? Stupid. When's your big brother gonna wake up? Thank you. Oh my gosh, look at the damage I just did. Oh my gosh! What is... Dude! Wow! Wow! You have no health! You're done! Oh my gosh! Did you even get to play? Holy moly! Cheat code's activated, actually. <laughs> wow! Yeah, I wish there was like silver stall knocks and stuff like that. Oh, wait, what the heck? How did I get 20? All right, whatever. Give me that. Well, this place was pretty well guarded. Let's see what what it was hiding. Hopefully hiding something good, huh? Give me something good. Give me something good. Ooh, bigger on sword. No way. This is one of the swords that you can make. It's like a series of trade quests in Ocarina of Time to get like one of the strongest swords. It's technically stronger than, than the master sword um, in, in the Ocarina of Time, if I remember correctly. But that's really cool. We're definitely going to put that up in our house. It's another unique item. That's super cool. Okay, I'm glad we came for that. And I think, yeah, we're pretty much done then with this area because all we got to do is just hop out and I think we're going to appear where we were before. We got all the light roots, so... What I want to do now is continue with the light roots. We just have a few left, actually. So, if we look here on our map, there's this really interesting looking structure. And, you know, remember, all water just ends up being blackened. It's like just pillars. So like any any sort of body of water just always ends up being just like cut off from society. In the last game, I'm pretty sure there was a shrine at the very end of this little curly thing. I didn't see it in the overworld when I was looking at it, but I'm assuming that it's still there, like probably part of like a, a shrine quest. So we're going to see. I'm pretty sure there's a light route at the very middle. So we are going to go down and check that out because it looks like there's a few things. Also, so this being Terrytown, there's probably something here too underneath Terrytown. So we haven't we haven't checked those areas out just yet. Yeah, let's start here and then we could head down. What in the world is all this over here, huh? There is something going on here. It looks like a mini game of sorts. Yeah, what the heck? Is this a theme park? We're gonna have to check it out. It looks like it's an extension of Terrytown. Well, regardless, we're not gonna get too distracted just yet. Let's head over this way. Our goal right now is to head over to where I think a shrine is. Yep, there it is. I see it. Wait, oh, there is a shrine there. I didn't, I didn't see that earlier. Maybe it didn't load. Interesting, which means there's a shrine here. Yep, All right. that means there's a light route there, is what I mean. Okay, and I see this guy right away. Where is your buddy, huh? Where is your friend? You got separated again, you dingus. Okay, he's kind of far, but that's okay. Y'all already know, stick him on the light cycle. Oh, are we supposed to go sledding? Oh, I think we're meant to go sledding. Actually, that sounds kind of fun. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's do that. I think we're meant to go sledding. We'll do the way that it was intended, you know? Hop aboard. Am I going to be okay if I just fly off? Time to find out. Whee! Whoa! Whoa! Actually, wait, hold on, hold on. Let's activate this uh, as a, a checkpoint and then we could just warp back, right? That's the smart thing to do. I'm not going to go in just yet, but we're going to, we're going to, we're going to be able to warp back more easily. All right, let's go. Whee! This is actually pretty sick. Fried chicken! Yeah, roasted bird drumstick. Hold on, where are you going, buddy? Get back here. You ain't escaping me. So th these sleds have pretty low, um, pretty low friction, huh? This is actually pretty cool. Go to sled around. Okay, I say that and then we get stuck right here. Well, no nothing will be ever beat the step cycle, but at least this was free. Roasted chicken! Whoa, what is that over there? What? Do you see that? Okay, hold on. Let's talk to you first. <laughs> Thank you. Is that a freaking... Yo, what? What is that? That's really cool. It reminds me of Universal Studios. Ocean World? What's that place called? I don't remember. Well, we definitely got to check that out later. And the other thing too is now that we're actually close to that shrine, why don't we just go for that shrine and, and, and do it? We're like right here. I also wanted to test if this could even flow in water. Not that it matters since we have the step of cycle, but uh, it's, it's good experimentation. Whee! Let's see. Nope, not at all. Alrighty then. 
We'll just swim. Or we could just ride this up, right? Well, actually, hold on. Yep, I'm just remembering there's actually something up here, too. Oh my gosh, we're getting so distracted from our original goal. But we're here! We should, we might as well actually do it, and no lie. Um, can we even reach it? Oh, it's really high up. Can we reach it? Uh, we could either, we could easily motorcycle to it, though. Whatever, let's do this shrine first. We can think about it later. Gemma Mick Shrine. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Turbine power. I feel like we've done something like this already. Okay, energy source needs to be connected. I think I remember something like this before in Breath of the Wild. Okay, I see this. It's a metal plate. I want to place that here. And then we don't want to touch it because I think we will get shocked. Yeah. Okay, so now this is... Okay, we need the, this thing on top, right? Whoop. Oh my freaking goodness. Hold on. There we go. And now what? Ah, this is actually quite cool. Get up there. Oh, there's a treasure chest over there too. Hold on. Cool. Get those off here. Do these light up or something? They do light up. Okay, do I just... Oh, what the heck? Okay, you know what? I think I understand. I think I get the assignment. We gotta like... Oh my gosh. There we go. Is that... What? Okay. Okay, so you do this. Let me stick it on. And then it's gonna do a freaking crazy fan of doom. That's gotta be enough, right? Yep, there we go. Kind of reminds me of having Din's Fire in Ocarina of Time to open the Shadow Temple. If you know, you know. Alrighty, give me the blessing. Here's the question. Do you want to do the sky area above this area right now since we're right underneath it? Or do you want to do the intended route, which is to go down to the depths? That's the question. That's the question. You know what? I say we should go do the intended route because if we go up here eventually, I think we'll just probably end up going over to this area with our with our cycle. So we'll save that for later. Uh, for now, let's stay on track. I'm going to go ahead and warp back here, do this shrine, and then we're going to hop down. You always got to have a system when you're exploring, guys. If you want to see everything possible, you got to plan things out. And I think you're you're able to enjoy way more of the game. That's at least how I, I like to do it. I'm a very structured, organized person, if you guys can't tell. It's very hard for me to be spontaneous because then I start to feel like I have less control and less control is a little bit harder for me. But that's just a me thing. Other than that, I'm a big, dumb idiot build, as always. But, you know, combat training. What? I'm getting trained all the way out here? Nah, come on. Sneak strike? I know what the sneak- Oh, come on, dude. Why are they teaching me sneak strike this late in? This is kind of weird. Well, we might as well equip our sneaky equipment. You guys such a dingus. What are you even looking at, bro? Whee! Are we done? Oh, now he's patrolling. Okay. Yay! We did it! Shut up! Give me the blessing, dude. I can't believe I'm getting a tutorial this late in. I'm like 100 hours into this game. <laughs> you think I don't know how to sneak strike by now? Shameful. Sneaky elixir. Blech. All right, we gotta get out of this outfit. I don't like this outfit. Let's go back to Majora's Mask. I do like me some Majora's Mask. We're at six blessings. Let's go. Okie dokie -o. Let's hop in there. East Akala Plains Chasm. Now we've already lit up all this area. Yep. Yes, we have. Yes, we have. So where do we want to go? We want to head over to this shrine. We also wanted to check out a few things. And this is a perfect time for me to show off what I was talking about earlier about the step of cycle mark four. Yeah, because C is really dark, right? We're going to venture in. Oh, frick. OK, you know what? Let's let's handle this frocks really quick. What are you trying to eat me? Oh. Thank you. Stupid. Oh, what? Already? All right, let's use our big boys. Spin. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Oh my gosh! Did we almost get him? Nice. Wow. We almost got him in one cycle. Up! Ah, we just needed one hit. That's actually insane. Woo-wee! Woo-wee! Let's go. Let's go. Alright, as I was saying, get one of these out, right? Great. So this is actually going to be the Mark IV. Check this out. If you take a Light Bloom, I'm gonna chuck it right on the front right there. 
What? Wait, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I didn't mean for it to activate, but my point is we basically got a free flashlight. Isn't that cool? Okay, how do I turn this off? Stop! Yeah, chill out, dude. Okay, great. So I get a free battery, like less, it's not very pretty, but check it out. It actually like lights the way forward. So what happened was initially when I was clearing this area, I was just going in dark. I hit a tree and I was like, whoa, 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 I can't see anything. I tried to chuck it and I actually chucked it onto my bike. And then this is what happened. I was like, yo, this is such a good idea. Look at this. But you, I could see well enough that I don't hit trees or anything now. Look, it's actually incredible. We keep finding new ways to optimize, and whenever you do, it's such a pleasure. Like a dinky, mystical, like, flying machine this is. I love it. Look, see? It's, like, really well lit. Because the br it's, like, following us, you know? Like the bright blue. No battery consumption. Even the flashlight didn't light up this well. Right? The flashlight barely lit up in front of us. We could barely see a thing. All right, let's go for this one. Nice, simple way to help with exploration in the depths. The more you know, guys, the more you know. All right. I don't know which light route this is, but we just need more light, so. Oh, great. I think this is probably good enough. I don't think we necessarily need to get any more. Although it looks like we're close to another light route. Let's go ahead and take a look at this and then we could go ahead and try to do this. Oh, whoa, look at that. Yeah, see, I had a feeling there's going to be some sort of like maze puzzle type thing. So we're going to go to the underneath the Terrytown one first and then we'll go over this way. That's the plan. That's the plan. All right. Up we go. Oh my gosh, I love the Stemma Cycle. Now there's literally no holes. The only thing that we're missing is a way to attack, but we don't even need to confront or attack when we're on this thing. We just hop off and use bullet time. But yeah, okay, so we're gonna head over to this. This looks to me like it's gonna be a forge. I could be wrong, which would make sense if it's underneath Terrytown. I think it's this, is it this hole right here? Yeah, I think it is. Oh, look at this. Wow, step a cycle, just zooming right in. Oh, it's so cool. I love this thing. If you nick something, you kind of fly off. But it's pretty, pretty good to control. Look at this. Yeah, this is almost definitely a forge. Almost definitely a forge. Look how easy it is to go up. Okay, hold on. That's the other thing. Remember when I told you we found the other Bargainer statue? We did actually unlock and bought the Dark Hood. So that's cool. I think, do we have the full Dark set then? Yeah, we actually do have the full dark set. I mean, I could show you guys what it looks like. It's just basically um, Shadow Link, right? Same as uh, like the Ocarina of Time one. Well, there's a lot of pose. Let's collect all this stuff. What's up, buddy? Gonna get a new Schema Stone, right? Give me that Schema Stone. Thank you, thank you. Instant Cannon! Whoa, 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 that looks cool. Is that gonna actually do a lot of damage? Hopefully. Wait, this is actually kind of sick. And then you can just mount it into the ground with this thing. This doesn't even look too expensive. Look at that. Boop. Oh, wow. Pew, 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 pew. Look at that. Wait, this is amazing. Now, we could probably optimize this to put it on like a little turret head so it, it like actually aims at people, right? Awesome. Nice. We'll take it. We'll take it. We should be able to actually get more batteries because I have been collecting more Zonite. So we could probably cash in here too now that we're here. Perfect. We'll take three of those and we'll buy all of this. Awesome. So we could actually get two thirds more. Actually, not a lot. Okay, cool. We're done. This one would be nice to have right underneath Terry Tarrytown. All right, let's head out. 